Hey everybody, thank you for joining me today. It's Mus here from Papa Bear Gaming. This video is looking at Destroy All Humans on Google Stadia. It is the latest Stadia game to drop on Stadia Pro for the month of December 2021, along with four other titles. Now, the reason I'm reviewing this particular video today is because of the results of my recent Twitter poll. I will leave the link in the description. And it was between Destroy All Humans um, and another Stadia Pro game, which was foreclosed. Now, the results were actually 50-50. So, being the nice person that I am, I've decided to create two videos, one for each. So, this is the first one, and the other one will follow soon. So, for now, let's take a look. Now, I should also mention that I've gone into the settings of this game to turn off all of the music, so that if um, there are any copyright claims, they won't affect the video. So, bear in mind that it's probably not your system that's faulty. Um, it's supposed to be fine. Hello, friends. Have you ever gazed up into the night sky and wondered at the possibility of life on other planets? What marvelous beings might exist out there? Hands extended in friendship awaiting the moment when we humans take our first tentative steps into space. What tales will be told of that glorious day when we are first contacted by our brothers from beyond the stars? Five. All systems go, General. Four. Come on, baby, show us what you got. Three. What the hell? Two. What in the blue blazes is that? One. No, wait, stop the countdown. Incompetent fool. I should never have sent you. What's shaking, Pox? You look a little, what's the word? Constipated. <sighs> Let's just say I hope you turn out to be less of an evolutionary dead end than your predecessor. You lost me. Shall I tell you a secret? Few of our people know this. But the DNA patterns in our cloning banks are becoming more and more degraded with each new clone. That's bad, right? Only if we want to retain our immortality through cloning. Of course it's bad! I sent Crypto-136 in search of a planet we visited many eons ago. A planet seeded with pure Furon DNA. But I lost contact. Let me get this straight. You sent me, uh, him. Crypto 136 to a hostile planet and he's disappeared. Maybe captured, maybe even being tortured as we speak. Well, I wouldn't jump to any conclusion. I bet you wouldn't. Let me tell you something, Pox. You're a smart cookie. But there's a time for thought and there's a time for action. And this is one of those times. Which? The second one. <sighs> Perhaps you're right, 137. Of course I'm right. You kidding me? A cryptosporidium captured by a bunch of monkeys? We gotta go in. We gotta crack some craniums. We gotta rescue me. Him. He's gotta rescue me. I mean, we gotta... I gotta... Brains, man. When do I get to blow things up? Patience, Crypto. Patience. I take your point. Prepare the mothership. 
That's what I'm talking about. So, what's the name of this crummy planet? Our destination. The planet Earth. Okay, let's do this. Box to Cryptosporidium 137. Come in, Cryptosporidium. Crypto here. How's the view from the safety of the mothership? Very funny. Let's just say I'm glad I'm up here and you're down there. Loathsome little planet. Now, Crypto! To ensure this invasion runs smoothly, it is imperative we identify the dominant life forms on this world. Those lactating bovoids are likely candidates. Surely you don't mean those foul-smelling gas bags beyond the fence. Yes, I'm afraid I do. But they're covered in nipples. Now, Cryptosporidium! <laughs> Do verify your suit is working under Earth's atmospheric conditions. Okay. Get on. On. <laughs> so, yes, sir. Okay. Move a look around. Show details. That's fair enough. Okay. <clears throat> um, okay. A very cool um, environment that they land you in. I like this. Oh. Can I get up there? Hey. Furon probes. Find down furon probes to gain extra DNA and unlock furonigami art. <laughs> furonigami art. Very cool. Okay. Oh. Okay. Cool. Okay. We can peer around. into the minds of lower life forms via the cortex scan. Rip the preliterate thoughts from their pathetic little brains. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what a surprise. Primitive. <clears throat> scan another one. <laughs> Let's scan you. Uh, <laughs> again with the moon. And you. These lactating bovoids are trying to fool us. <laughs> Very funny. They eat with their mouths. Ugh, I think I'm going to be violently ill. 
Attention, Earth creatures. This planet is now part of the Furon Empire. Your benevolent masters welcome you. At this time, we wish to abduct you for the purpose of scientific research. The procedure will be protracted and invasive. Do you have any objections? Earth creature, I am addressing you. Respond oh, no. or be vaporized. <laughs> I don't nice. care how many stomachs you have. I don't have time for this. Do I have to vaporize a cow now? The astounding power of psychokinesis. Grab a march target and throw it. Oh. Lift it into the sky. Okay. Use PK to finish off oh, the nice. Um. Oh, poor cows. This is very cool, the mind control thing. Am I supposed to try and kill them all? There we are. Mm, Martha, you didn't tell me we was having barbecue for dinner. <laughs> Wait a minute, that ain't steak. That's holy mother. Martha, give me the shotgun. Wow. This looks like a job for the Zapomatic. Fry that farmer. Extract and collect the brainstem from what's left <laughs> of the agricultural engineer. Uh, extract brain. I know I was supposed to shoot the guy, but I thought at least the hay bale may have been slightly nicer. Oh wow, this is pretty grim. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Green. Right. Did she just not care that her husband had been beheaded? Okay. As long as shields have energy, they protect you from harm. A gauge showing the current charge appears when the shield isn't fully charged. Okay. When you get hit or touch, water shield energy depletes. Some impacts deal more damage than others. If not damaged further, the shield slowly recharges after a few seconds. The shield bar turns red when it is out of energy. When it's out of energy. Any hits could be lethal. Dodge projectiles or retreat from a battle until shields begin, shields begin recharging. Collecting brain stems reduces the shield recharge delay. The saucer also has a shield. To recharge, use its drain ability on humans or vehicles instead. The saucer shield doesn't recharge automatically. Right. Let none survive. <clears throat> so let's go in and get Martha if I can. Oh, okay. Oh, nice. What's this? Communist Russia? Ah! <laughs> uh, I think he's dead. Oh, wait, wait. Who's getting me? Where are they? Oh, there's one there. No, there's not. Ignore me. Ah, let's pick you up. Oh no. <laughs> I was so busy playing with the telekinesis that I died. Oh dear. It's a bullseye. Black suited officials confiscate Hunter's strange catch. Oh. Okay, let, let's retry this. So, yep, yep, yep. Okay. You got it, sir. Show some respect. Oh, cool, so you can extract brains as you're shooting, which is nice. <coughs> Off you go, buddy. There we go. Can you get from any distance? Oh, I'm being shot at. Who's shooting me? Oh, you. I did not see you, pal. Well, let's just throw you into the building. Okay, this is pretty fun. <laughs> wow. 
I'm enjoying the sort of the, the gory side of it as well, even though it's clearly a very cartoony experience. It's, it's very cool. I mean, there will be those of you that have played this in the past who know exactly what I mean. This is very cool. Evening, Ms. Turnip Seed. We got a call from Farmer Dixon over the other side of the state road. Said he heard some pretty strange noises coming from over this way. Little green spaceman! What is that? A new silo? Electrocuted him with a big old crypto! That human law enforcement officer is attempting an unauthorized entry of your spacecraft. If those pea brains were to get their hands on your quantum deconstructor, wow. they could rip a hole in the space time continuum. I guess I better stop them then. Oh, the Furonity. Vaporize them, Crypto. Oh, nice. Now let's throw you into the ship. <laughs> let's extract some brains. Oh, that's not Martha. Sorry, that's a rock. Where did she go? Aha, she's there. <clears throat> so this is cool. Let's take that out. So that's done. Where's the other guy? Something. Oh, did not see you there. Hang on a minute, who are you? Woody bus. Allow me to just collect everybody's brains first and I'll be right on it. Step beneath the saucer to enter. I love the fact that this is from the perspective of the aliens. <laughs> that you have to basically try and take over the Earth. This is good fun. Really good fun. Take a spin in your saucer. Okay. Get the controls and then go ahead and start shooting. Right. Destroy all buildings. Leave no trace. So R two is a death ray. Oh, this is this is awesome. Look at this. Perfect. Awesome. What else do we have? Where are the other buildings? There must be another. Oh, there we are. Just take the house out quickly. They won't need it anymore anyway. <laughs> I think. Oh, no, no, no. There's one more sneaky building. Is there? There's this big red dot here. Let's see. Is it the police car? Well, I mean, I should do right. <laughs> there we go. The red dot has gone. Okay, so let's see. Oh, the water effect's pretty good. Not bad at all. I wonder if I can blast through rocks with this thing. Uh, nope, rocks are impervious to death rays, apparently. There we are. Focus! Okay, okay. <laughs> Keep your tubes on. Is it the pig pen? Oh, poor pig. All right. All right. Or the cows, even. Sorry. Looks like a pig star to me. Okay. I believe. What is it? Oh. Nice shooting, Crypto. Thanks, boss. Must admit, it took me a while to find everything, but thanks. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Move out, man! Move, move, move! I don't know, but I've been told. I don't know, but I've been told. <laughs> Joe McCarthy's good as gold. Joe, Joe McCarthy's good as gold. Joe. Oh, great. The human military industrial <sighs> complex. We can't allow them to alert their leaders to our presence. Exterminate them. Now! Okie dokie, boss. Open fire! Wow. There's no messing with these guys. Crypto. I hereby give you official permission to. Destroy all humans. Hey, he said it. <laughs> I 
land on them? No, I can't. So you're dead. Oh, and you are also dead. Where are you, human? Oh, pesky human. Oh. oh, I see. Well, I just... Um... Oh, oh, oh. Okay, where are the vehicles? Oh, let's drain. Superb! Where are we? If I go here, they should follow me. I'm going to take this down, because I don't like the look of this. <laughs> okay. Where are you, pal? Oh wow, you really are um, quick on your feet, aren't you? Okay, and there's one more thing here, which I'm guessing I can't do anything to that. Can I? The humans are making a final push. Ah. Wipe them out once and for all. Woody boss. <laughs> right, where are the others? Oh, cool. Cool, and you. Let's blow this up anyway. Come on, Tan. I was already blown up. Forgive me. I I'm new to this sort of taking over the planet business, so just bear with me. Oh, so I'm at 100%. That makes sense. No, no. Ignore me. <laughs> I destroyed that fruit stand. That fruit and veg stand. Hmm. Did you see what I saw? You bet your sweet ass I did. <laughs> what did you see? Little green man <laughs> in a flying saucer wiping out the best infantry unit in the U.S. Army. Right, good. Me too. Green? Not gray? Don't be a stiff. You know what it means? Absolutely. What? <laughs> it means the papers got it right for once. Get on the horn to silhouette. We've got the worst case scenario. The eggheads were actually onto something? I don't believe it. Believe it. Roswell was only the beginning. The invasion is on. The invasion is on. Yay. <clears throat> Drown a cow in the lake. Kill the farmer's wife using a chicken. <laughs> okay. Unlocked. Cortex scan psychokinesis, epimatic brain extraction, jetpack thrusters, death ray, energy drain matrix system. Newman Pox Lab, Iridium Arc Splitter, Flux of Cell Capacitor, Nuclear Blister Inducer, Liquid N2 Cooling. Right. And I've received 800 DNA and some new artwork, apparently, so that's fun. Cattle mutilation pandemic. Farmer disappears amidst cow abuse allegation. <laughs> oh, no. Good old government cover-ups, eh? <laughs> this is really good fun. you're thinking <clears throat> what can i a lowly novice do to help bring about the destruction of earth and the inevitable reign of the furon empire well i'll tell you it was in the earliest days of the empire we realized our species was doomed eons of waging war on inferior races with unregulated atomic weaponry had mutated our genes we could not propagate due to our complete and utter lack of genitalia Fortunately, a Furon ship happened upon Earth on its way back from destroying the Martians. Human society was young and nubile. Sailors on a foreign planet letting off steam, one thing led to another. Long story short, every human being alive today has buried deep in his genetic code a strand of Furon DNA. 
Ah. For many eons, we've learned to clone ourselves. But with each iteration, the information degrades, and the results are increasingly unpredictable. The Furon genes in humanity's DNA are ancient, uncorrupted. They represent the future of the <laughs> Furon race. If only we can get at them. What a cool story. I like this. Welcome to my little laboratory. You may not have known this, but I flatter myself to be something of an inventor. In my spare time, I've been developing some truly impressive weapon and ability upgrades. I'd be happy to share them with you. If you've got something for me in trade, say some of that delicious DNA you've collected. Hmm? <laughs> okay, so you can effectively spend your DNA. So I've, in my case, I've got 1,125 DNA. Um, so crypto, so you can get disintegrate array, right, dash, cool text scan, and saucer, what can I get for my saucer? I've got the death ray, sonic boom, quantum deconstructor. Quantum deconstructor sounds good. Saucer shield, repulsatron. <laughs> How do I know what they are? Let's just, um... Let's click on one that I may well want if I can do that. So let's see. Oh, it's a gamma particle enrichment. Increases the size of the explosion. Increase quantum. Okay, so this is cool. It's like a skill tree, effectively, for each of your, um, your or for both your character and or the saucer that your character inhabits. Brain extraction, right. Cognito has a pattern alpha. Brain is actually admitted to another specimen when a human's head explodes. Oh, right. So you don't actually lose the brain, I think. So multiple specimens. And then the ultimate version is humans in the final stages of brain extraction attack their former ally. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Okay. So, I mean, I don't have much in terms of currency. I have 1,125. So let's just see. So I can get the first of... Oh, no, I can get the... Um, yeah, so the orange ones are the things I can buy. Nope, ignore that. <laughs> Disintegrate array. Okay, so I'm not going to... Wow. <laughs> I've got to have a lot. Uh, anal probe, sniffer sensors, increase the time window for successful probing. Butt pressure amplifier, increases the damage dealt by successful probes. Proboscis sensors, greatly increases the time window for successful probing. Butt measure, pressure maximizer, greatly increases the damage dealt by successful probes. Centipedal probulator. Successful probes chained to nearby targets when they burst out of the current subject. Okay, which sounds basically like a human centipede type thing. And rectal packages supreme. <laughs> Crypto can deploy multiple probes at the same time. <laughs> That's so amusing. Okay. I'm going to um I'm going to leave it. I was going to remove that that option from my screen. There we go, just so that I don't keep chuckling at it. Okay, what can I say? Um, destroy all humans. Really good fun. I thoroughly enjoy the cartoony style of it and also the, so we say, the stereotypical representations of some of their characters. <laughs> Highly amusing, if not a little bit offensive to some, but it's clearly, um, it's clearly done in jest, so hopefully it's received that way as well. The gameplay. Um, it, it's a pretty sort of straightforward... Um, 3d platformer you know you run around you've got to shoot things blow certain things up you've got different tools at your disposal you've got different tasks and milestones that need completing before you can progress on to the next stage uh, once again this is a google stadia pro title for the month of december 2021 so stadia pro subscribers will get this for no extra money which is awesome and it's definitely one i can see people just having a little bit of fun with you know dipping in and out it doesn't appear to be the deepest of stories, which is good. Uh, speaking of which, as I touched on earlier, the story is, in fact, quite an interesting one. You can tell some thoughts gone into it. But again, it's, it's nothing sort of epic, which is good. So it's probably a good party game to play with friends. Um, and as mentioned, if you fancy a quick 30-minute, 60-minute session, you can jump into this and have a lot of fun with it, I'm sure. So that's it from me. If you've enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up and also kindly subscribe to my channel for all of my latest content. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you on the next one.